welcome back. I know this might be a while, but hey, I'm finally posting again. Because like, I finally found an idea. Okay, so this is basically a fun game called Block Tales, right? Block Tales? I'm also obviously I'm recording on my old because I have a But I played this. Okay, you obviously know. Of course. We're met. But either way, here's, here's a tutorial. Sorry, I didn't really know how to play the game. Here's just a bit of gameplay. So basically, here's Q, and then here's, uh, and if you press shift, and you can, and you can dash, but later there has, there's an end lag, so it's recommended to jump. Yes, this is basically a tutorial, a better version, and basically more of a gameplay as well, mixing it together, so, here. We don't need to explain anything. Here's a prologue, hello world. Basically explains the entire game, so. This is very easy. Oh, right, there's a, there's a shop where you can spend your bucks. There's the guy where you can donate. I forgot about this guy. This place, okay, behind that place, the cafe is very useful. I will come back there later. There's a couple more NPCs. Or the guest, he doesn't talk. Cause you know, obviously that's what guest does. There's a Roblox HQ. Nice. I and here's the dummy. So basically, you okay? So basically, you can just technically play the game with just your keypad. So you, like, I'm I'm currently pressing A A and W A S W whatever. Okay, now here's the ball, and then use it on the NPC. And right before the ball is about to hit, press space. Also, yes, this this is good. This is only good to include computer. I'm not gonna include any mobile, tablet, etc. This is just purely on computer base, so it's for anyone new in the game. And the, if you look here, you can you can press Q to have a you, you can press Q to strike first, which does include you having one more attack damage, and this does stay until you finally use your turn. So I hit once and I hit it again. That's a two. You cannot repeat it. You cannot repeat it. So it's not so it's not like a little machine gun. So you, you can only hit it two times per enemy. And if the and if the NPC is one HP, but you hit it with a double hit, uh, it will still hit the same thing. Here's what I'm talking about. Here's bucks. You can use you can spend those bucks on that little sketchy guy you, you saw. So basically, uh, you have two turns each. The enemy they have like um uh, one turn, one turn, one turn, one turn. And then, uh, it, right before, okay, so basically, if, if they're about to hit you, you can do two things if you press space at the right time. One, you can block it, which, which blocks all damage, if the damage is low enough, or you, or you can, um, like, counter it, and then, like, later you obey the attack and hit the opponent for one damage. Very useful. Yeah, but if it's a projectile like that or something undodgeable, like more like something more undodgeable, it it you will dodge, but you won't counter attack. Like including like arrows, balls, paws, um, like anything like ground AOE move ish, whatever. Who cares? And then here's our little first boss fight. Not that bad. Here's blue and red, blue and red noob. If you are new, you might have difficulty, but if you all uh, like pay attention to this tutorial, you might, you might, this might be a bit easier for you. And sorry for my stuttering, I do not really plan the script. Well, I will follow the end. See? I, okay, I guarded it. Look who su successfully blocked. And then here successfully countered. Well, countered. Okay, here's a tip. If you defeat one of these, they will gain an infinite attack boost. Because, you know, like, they're, like, kind of like in a romantic shape, if I can guess. Like, if you look here, there's blue. And then how dare you hurt her. So, I can already guess it might be, you know, like, a little romantic shape right here. It might not be that fun to, you know, I really know what to do. But, hey, at, le at least um, the noob will know what to do. Because if... Because y'all can just watch this video. Very simple. Not that hard. And here it is. I won. 
you can you can press space and E at the same time or like individually each one. Like if you can hear this right now. That that you can skip the dialogue really like fast because that's not really that important right now. And later, uh, shed shed let's go. He's gonna inform you about the sword of height swords. It's gonna give you a wooden sword, and you can and you can break wooden planks with this. That's gonna bring you to the basement. You're gonna come down here later on chapter two, whatever. Little little bit of a spoiler, but not that important either way. And here, here's the planks. You you can destroy that. And uh, here, and we go on fight. So basically, if you see here right here, you can see a little spike. That the the ball won't work on it, or else it will pop. So you ha you are used to the sword. You have to hold space and then let go when the little two arrows reach the green area, so you are able to do a, more of a critical hit. It has to be near. It has to be exactly on it, but it has to be near it, like a couple pixels near ish. Like it happens to be once in a while. Also, another thing is that um, after you win a battle, you should gain one HP and one special point. Okay, here's the toy Terry again, and he's gonna give us a little card. Yes, I do know how cards work. I uh, don't worry, I'll teach. I'll teach you. No, I did not mean that. But hey, of course. Okay, this is very simple. This is very simple. Very simple. That uh, yep. So basically, so basically, there's something called build points. I'm not sure about these build points. I'll research more later. And okay, so if you see right here, there's a single dot. This one, the, these two, do they do not have build points each in their own individual ways. But it will um, wait. But this does have build points. So basically, if you see here, we have build points here, build points left, and we have two slots more. So this this only takes one, not that special. And then later, if we go in a fight like this one. Okay, it's not okay. Actually, I should have wasted my SP, which is my special points. This is hit points if you're wondering about that, and you chose your number. Whoop. Let's continue on with it. Okay, here's okay. Here's a good ending. This one. So basically, here's special points. I have all, I only have five since I did start to do a count. And here's power shot. It costs three. Literally the same thing, but it's got a bit faster. But it does 4 HP if it's a wooden sword, but if you hit first, it will do 5. Really good. Because a lot of NPCs, they're gonna have. Oh, we don't need to go there. So, first attack this. So, first attack this. Okay, so you can see here, there's like a little like wing icon. You cannot use your. You're gonna use your sword on it. Continue. It's, it's only. It's, in fly, it's a flying enemy. You cannot just like. Yeah, whatever. You, you, you understand it. And then, so, you have to use your ball. Either way, why did it say ball so hard like that? Pause. Whoop. Well, okay. Here it is. And then we should go on to the next part. Oh yeah, if you look here at the bottom right, bro. If you okay, so if you are not in a fight like what I did right now. Um, you should go into a fight, and later when this fight happens, like, no, no, wait, what am I saying? No, I'm saying the wrong thing. When you're not in the fight, like, when you're out in the open world, you can see in your bottom left corner, I'll show you later. You can show in your bottom left corner, um, like, your, like, your little stats, like, your HP you currently have, the amount of SP you currently have, and, like, the amount of, like, X and, like, um, ticks you have. Later, so basically, here's a each time you defeat an enemy, you get tick, a, exp, and ticks. Okay, so you're sixty. I have sixty-two ticks, and I have one hundred seven ticks. No, e, exp and ticks. Okay, but either way, okay. So if you reach one hundred, no matter what level you are, if you reach a hundred, you will you will go to the next level. Ticks you can spend in like some like areas that like do it include the shop. Uh, I I will show you later. Actually, why not show you now? Okay, so basically, if you if you press tab, go in map, which is which should be the second wait, which should be the second last tab right here. You can go to Bizville, right? Come here and go here. 
this shop is very useful for you if you are trying to go through this game really fast. You can go here and get the double cheeseburger because it's, it's a bit more expensive. Now, like I know this like this might be a better deal, but this is like way faster. But I would recommend this if you are really really low on chicks. But if you know how to use this, yeah sure. But personally, I would buy the cheeseburger because you know you might need it later and yeah. And here's the etc. Here's the, here's the attack spec. Sound effects, whatever. Here's the HQ basement. And sorry if I'm talking a whole bit fast or like if I'm a bit annoying. I I am hyper. I ate like three cupcakes. I don't know if like not that much, but the amount of sugar they put on that, which is just insane. Also, if you don't want to get in a fight, you could you could possibly defend. Actually, yeah, never mind. You can run away. Which you, you see, and this will all the run away, but it failed. But you have two tries, so don't worry. The second try should be should be a guaranteed run away, so don't worry. And yes, you can join your with a friend, because if you look here, you can party up with someone. And you can invite them to a party. And you don't need the party for this uh kind of like thing. But if someone is in a fight, you should see like a little like little smoke cloud. And if you go near it to the middle, and if you press E. Uh, you will uh go in that fight with the other person. You cannot kill each other. No friendly fire. At all. I'm sorry if the video is a bit long, but this is more of a tutorial and gameplay, so I'm sorry. And we're just gonna ignore the chat and don't mind if someone said English or Spanish. Don't worry, y'all can move. That wasn't that was I did not mean to do the joke either way, but. Who cares? Y'all can move, don't worry. And here we go, we defeated the angel wins, cause like, it is better for y'all. Okay, if, if you want low level, I wouldn't recommend running, cause you know, you do need EXP to level up. So I won't, I won't, um, yeah. Oh yeah, later if you do level up, you, you have the option to increase your health, your health, your uh special points, and your build points. Personally, I would recommend to build up your like either one, like what you have trouble with. Like either one you have trouble with, like if you have like trouble with HP, special points, or build points, because you want you want more cards. Uh, yeah, either one. Let's see someone drop my bottom. They're not in my party, so don't worry. So basically, we have to wait. Here's a little timer right here. This is gonna be important later on in the game. Don't worry about that. Sword energy. But yeah, this guy technically, technically stole my game. Well, you you can do that with other people's games. You you can just like find it and steal their game. Like you can just go in it and like technically steal the rewards without you doing anything really. But well, you can do that to like to your advantage if if uh, if you are playing with friends, yes. Okay, so here's the dummy, and he has and he has a uh, two two of these. Uh, it, um, it's like a little block. So basically, for example, if I use a ball, which I can easily tell, but I still won't to like explain it for you guys. If I hit him like this, he will go down, and, but it won't hit him, negating negating that um the ball. But if I use the sword, it goes through the little block. So. Yeah, very useful. Oh yeah, I would recommend y'all to um probably uh learn how to parry or block, cause they are very useful. Cause you know you don't die easily. Which for any new people, including me, well I did start like two three days ago, but I already know how to play the game easily. Uh, it is very like. It is each I would recommend to probably uh learn how to block it is very important yes block parry same thing but yes this uh this dummy will will take away one damage so my tip for uh blocking or countering is like when they make an odd move like this like that like 
like he took the stance, but later he moved. Like you just gotta wait for him like to like fully extend his arm, and then that's when I would press space. But you gotta have re good reaction time because of that. But I don't mind. I don't mind y'all try it out. GG. Oh, we're about to reach the next level. Okay. So later, okay. So currently, we're currently on uh, ninety one. We're I'm gonna show you a good example here. Bro, and my AC didn't work, but I don't really care. Oh, uh, sword. Okay, that did not work that well. Okay, come on. Block that. I don't really recommend wasting your SP on this. Like, it is gonna be fast, but it will take you a while to get back. Besides, if you do have items. So, items can do a lot of things. They they explain what they do in, in the description. If you like, do this, go to items, and then they give you to like click on there. They give you hover cursor a little bit, and then it should show you a little description here. Which looks like it should be really good. Okay, you can go here. Or actually, oh wait, I, wait, I'm tripping. My bad. You can go here. There should be a, like a little gravity coil, and you should get a free cheese because right here. Jump down. Go to this cutscene, and then here's Lu New Labrador. Whatever. I don't. I don't care how you pronounce it. And later, uh, later you're gonna go in a fight with Noob Avador and Red Blue and Noob, and Red and Blue Noob. So what I recommend is to first time your ball right on Red Noob first, or Blue Noob if they are in front. And later focus your ball on the Blue Noob Avador. So, so you just have this guy left. Also yes, if you use if you use an item, it will waste your one HP coins. Yes, so be wary of that. And you see, I'm having a bit of trouble with timing the counter, but hey, no biggie. Who cares? Also, if you do get in a party, and if the um whoever gets in a boss fight like one of these, well, like I'll say mini boss fight, uh, you will be dragged into that as well, if you wish. And here you go. We we just unlocked Hello World. We did the first chapter. Let's see. That was our first boss, or the first prologue. You can do deal points, special points, and HP. But personally, we are currently running a bit low on HP points. Cause we do use our power stab very often, very very often. So I would very recommend to use it on special points. Just ignore them. Here's box right here. Oh wait, I should probably end the video right here. Yeah, I should probably, cause that was a prologue. So, yeah. If y'all like to make me another video about this, yeah, I would happily do so. Actually, I'll do it right now. Like after after I end this video, I'll like I'll probably like, edit it a bit. Well, actually, I probably won't edit it. And later, I'll, like and I will like you know like publish this, make make it like another YouTube Shorts, cause we, there is other kids that still scroll through YouTube Shorts, and they probably looking through box hill so yeah if you guys like the video i am i am like so sorry to say this but if you like the video like and subscribe i know it's very annoying but yeah i still have to ask either ways because it's one of the most efficient ways and i know y'all might not subscribe but hey who cares i don't care y'all can even go subscribe i don't give i don't care really i make this just for fun but yeah it, it will be really glad if you do subscribe and 
if you do have notifications on, I would recommend for you to have like the notification bell on, cause it will notify you if I make another video, and there is a chance I will make one of these. With and the chance will be one hundred percent. I will make another video on this chapter one. Well, yeah. See you and have a good day.